apprentice. I see you've landed on Nar Shaddaa. It is, I'm afraid, the armpit of the galaxy. Why do you say that? Nar Shaddaa is a planet of frivolity and distraction. Gambling, spice, rampant black market and gang territory disputes. But you are there to eliminate my spy, Agent Delicon. Normally it would be a trifling task, but Delicon has acquired a powerful ally. Tell me his name so I know what to put on his epitaph. Agent Delicon's new benefactor is a young Sith Lord named Rothari, an upstart who openly disrespects my methods. Rathari prefers a more blunt approach. The Dark Council has granted him dominion over Sith interests on Nar Shaddaa. What possessed the Council to do such a thing? Rathari has been effective at ingratiating himself to the Council. Agent Delicon knows much about my organization. I cannot have Rathari in possession of such a resource. Burn Rathari to the ground. Destroy everything he's working for and kill Agent Delicon. They will suffer as no one has suffered. Haladrel Setson runs my slave operation on Nar Shaddaa. She has been a valued operative for many years. She is ready to receive you and can fill you in on Rathari's movements and interests. That is all. Where do you think you're sending that scan? Forgive the unorthodox introductions, Moro Weizen, Head of Special Operations for the Imperial Diplomatic Service. I need assistance plucking a thorn from the Empire's side. It should be a trivial task for a Sith, my lord, but I want the world to see your power. The world already fears me, as should you. Of course, I meant no disrespect. I was tasked with gathering allies on Nar Shaddaa. Hut clans, corporations, gangsters. But one man has resisted our entreaties. Ukabi is the local leader of the exchange. A galaxy spanning criminal organizations specializing in high tech vice. Ukabi and the exchange refuse to join us. You want me to convince this Ukabi to change his mind? We're long past that point. The exchange spends more money than most governments on spies, slicers, and scientists. Anyone they can't buy, they kidnap. They would have been valuable friends, but Akabi drugs and tortures my messengers. We need to make an example of him. What would have to be done? I want his army decimated, his arms cachets looted, his chemical refineries razed to the ground. I want to show a force so overwhelming that no one on Nashadar will ever deny the Empire again. If you would grant us this favor. You shall witness the might of the Sith and the fall of the Exchange. The Exchange operates out of the Corellian sector of the city. Your path of destruction begins there. When you're through crippling the operations, you can find me at my command post. I'll be watching the chaos from my chambers. pads are currently open for business. If you have information concerning the Empire, 
I'd suggest you surrender it. Raka kem you am kam nem nu. Nam gan bak um nok ki jak. Kam ino mem nu. Naja naya am kam mimik meraka. Tell me who's responsible. You kaki mem paninu. Am kapina pek mem nu kim gam. Mem amak kupka kramanik um nu ki gam mayamak. What's your price tag? Bumogala apayang. Nila ma ini anka anga. Nulilak apajam kamgam. Anka nem nang. Ampa nem nang memua inok. We talk me all day, darling. The exchange is moving in on this operation of yours. No amount of sugar gonna change that. Believe me, you're going to prefer the sugar to the spice. Take one step closer and there'll be two dozen Sith surrounding you. Two dozen? That's a dead giveaway, darling. You got none. These are your last breathing moments. Now what you say, Big Shot? Ha! We've been trained to handle Sith. Kinda glad we get to show off. Kill the Sith. You have a flair for dramatic entrances. I probably could have handled that, but uh, I'm grateful for your timing. You're the apprentice Darth Barris prepped for me, yes? You figured it out. The obvious is my specialty. That's why I keep petitioning the Darth for a raise. Halidrell sets in. So you're here to take out Lord Rathari. Won't be easy. He usually just appears, devastates, then disappears. You'll have to draw him out. He's been making some major power plays, and disrupting them will get his attention. Sounds like a plan. Barris trusts me for a reason. First, Rathari's been strong-arming the Hutt cartel. From what I hear, they're close to signing over some important territories to him. He and his apprentice Girik are in conference with the Huts at cartel headquarters. If you burst in... I'd be facing a lot of firepower. Well, yeah, if you just went in there lightsaber blazing. The cartel is an imperial ally. Rathari can't just beat on them. He has to play diplomat. Unfortunately, the same applies for you. If things turn violent between you and the Huts, better if there's no one left to identify you. There won't be a heart left beating. It could get hairy. Those oversized slugs have some pretty buff bodyguards. I've got a shipment of slaves to send out, but I'll be here if you need me. Good luck, my lord.
Excuse me, I'm on surveillance duty. <laughs> the things huts do behind closed doors. This is important. Slicers were selling intelligence reports on the black market. I recovered them. These? These are my reports? Well, thank you, my lord. No telling what would happen if these fell into the wrong hands. Wait, these reports are embedded with slicing signatures. This isn't some gang. It's the mark of the Republic's Strategic Information Service. The Republic will answer for their spineless scheme. The SIS hid behind the Slicer Gang. But why? Maybe to disguise a listening post. Maybe they're listening to us right now. Do you hear me, SIS dogs? The Dark Side is about to crush your pathetic operation. Isn't that right, my lord? There won't be a heart left beating. The SIS signatures contain coordinates. Go there. Destroy the listening post. Kill everyone. Godoba, please. I have good news. Do not attempt to dissimulate. No dissimulation intended. But I wanted you to meet someone. My lord, allow me to introduce the diplomatic services allies on Narshadar. The Shadow Syndicate. I don't need to meet the locals. Get rid of them. This won't take long. They need to know what you did. Godoba the Hut, owner of the club Vertica Casino and Five City Sectors. Your ship is docked in his spaceport. Varko Ti, Chomash of the Narshadar Labor Alliance. There are no better slavers in the galaxy. A pleasure. And last, DXTX, primary hub of the DX Annihilator Network. Your destructive prowess is respectable. Negotiations permitted. Together, they represent key powers. Yukabi and the Exchange could have joined them, but thanks to your strike, we needn't worry about the Exchange anymore. Too bad, I still feel like killing. Then you, of all of us, may be in luck. This woman has lied to you. What? What? <laughs> She has blundered where many upstarts blundered before, and now we all pay the price. You reek of fear. Varka, really? We're hardly vulnerable. Uval. 
He's preparing an army of steaming hot killers and cybernetically linked assassins. Detonite droid production has increased. Ah, very well. If Yukabi won't learn his lesson, then the Empire can handle his dying blows. Quiet. You've caused plenty of trouble already. My sources report exchange death squads on the move. As you destroyed his assets, he'll destroy ours. The promenade, factories, slave pens. Ukabi is drawing energy for his chemical enhancement facilities. He augments soldiers for battle. He must be stopped now. I'm not a strategist. Your recommendation, my lord? Let the exchange target civilians while we carve out their heart. These enhancement facilities, what are they? You'll have to destroy the tanks and face their creations. I'll alert our forces here and keep the Shadow Syndicate in line. We can discuss this when you return.
I was successful. I know. I intercepted their listening post's final transmissions. Got some Republic secrets. Even heard their dying screams. Twice now, you've saved intelligence, and I won't forget it. Now if you'll excuse me, surveillance duty calls. Made an unforgivable mistake. You began this conflict. All our businesses suffer. Now you all die. That's big talk from a terrified little gangster. The attacker. You have weakened my forces, but my death squads wade through blood as we speak. I have killed your kind before, Sith. I will again. It looks bad, I know, but I've been working on a strategy. Leave the strategizing to people who know better. Let her speak. If she fails us again, she knows she'll pay the price. Our guards captured a few of the gangsters. The exchange is based in the tunnels running under this sector. Maybe now's the time to push. Wipe them out. Their leaders, along with Yukabi. The DX Annihilator Network approves. Perhaps I think I speak on behalf of the Shadow Syndicate when I ask. With due respect, can this be done? I'm not easily destroyed. You'll have to take out the members of Yukabi's inner circle. All of them are cybernetically enhanced. Custom built masterworks, equal to a dozen Mandalorian warriors. When they're dead, proceed to Yukabi's chambers. Do... whatever you have to do. Oh! <laughs> 
don't really want to talk right now. My lord, are you there, my lord? It's Mora Vizen. I'm here. The inner circle of the exchange is dead, but their leader is missing. That's because he's here! Yukabi is here! Someone sold us out. Get back as soon as you can. We can't hold them. What shall it be? Does one die? Do both? You horrible worm! You are both wretched, and now you here to rescue the woman and the traitor. I am Ukabi. I am your destruction. Look upon my body. Cortosis skin grafts. Intravenous colto injection system. Holographic targeting array. You are only mortal. I will always prevail. If I die, I'm going to haunt you. I don't think he's getting up. Colto injections can't restore a dead man. Don't you dare talk. You brought him here. You tried to get me killed. Godoba, what do you have to say? Maybe, but you made the call to Akabi. Defy this woman, and you defy the greatest power in the galaxy. How dare you? The Shadow Syndicate is in my debt. Don't forget it. Why? Puta yastuka sun tangida. I promise, the unfortunate loss of Marovision will not inhibit our alliance with the Empire. The DX Annihilator Network will supply data on exchange activities. They will reassemble. We'll work to crush them and all the Empire's enemies on Narshada. Our promise. This whole moon will be under our control. That is the dream. 
pads are currently open for business. Greetings. I heard of your success with the Shadow Syndicate. I was hoping you might put those talents to work for me. My name is Mardel Felth, Imperial Intelligence, and I am here to stop a revolution. I've been known to stop or start a few wars in my day. They call this place the Duros Sector, but it's not just Duros who live here. Alien refugees from across the galaxy have fled here, fled from us. Now a leader has emerged to unite the different species. They call him the Flame, and we have killed him twice. Each time he reappears. The locals claim he is immortal. Is that possible? Only the Emperor himself can claim true immortality. But I'm not asking you to kill the Flame. Yet. Our only undercover agent in his gang was recently discovered and murdered. The Flame insisted the corpse be publicly displayed in Ranamas Square to taunt us. If they're baiting you, they want something. Oh, there's no doubt it's a trap. But they have bait we are hard-pressed to resist. Everything our agent found, all his notes, are pinned to the corpse in plain view. But every team I've sent to retrieve the records has come back in pieces. You may be the only one who could walk into this trap and survive. Let these aliens do their worst. They have not faced a Sith before. That was my thought precisely, my lord. We need those records back. Admiral Dufand Arge is due to arrive today to speak with the Huts about this problem. Once you have the records, use this on the body to burn it. We can't have them use one of our own as a rallying point.
You would be wise to bend to the great Lord Rathari's will. Sign over the specified territories before he loses his patience. I am your other choice. I'll tell you who this is. This is the apprentice of an over-the-hill Sith named Darth Barras. Yes, that's right. My master and I anticipated your arrival. Where is your master, Worm? I am Lord Rathari's proxy in dealing with the cartel, and I will be his sword arm dealing with you. I have no quarrel with you, but Rathari must die. I urge you to stand aside and watch me dispatch this pretender. What are the odds you huts survive my attack? Uipa mojo, poka tula, charnusa asubi mota. Upaton ti tok maki chisa chuola wamuni. Our alliance begins with the death of Barris's slave. Attack! will still be you and your master's downfall. Your master will be as dead as you soon enough. Your trap's been sprung. Here are the notes. Let me see. Blasted rebels. The Flame is planning an attack on Admiral Jafand Ange. He can't know about this. I was supposed to... What exactly would you prefer I didn't know? Admiral Jafand? Sir, I apologize. This is... I know who you are, my lord. 
It is an honor to have one of your stature helping us on Narshadar. Are you more inclined than Agent Maddell to tell me what threat has just been posed? Does this come from the flame? Any idea why he'd have it in for you personally? The flame must know I've been communicating with the hut. I'm here to tell them the Empire will withdraw billions of credits of business from Narshadar unless they shut down this rebellion. Killing you would be quite a coup for the flame. We must teach him the folly of targeting the Empire. I invite you to come with me when I meet with the Huts. Your activities have made an impression on the cartel. What exactly do you expect from me? Accompany me to the meeting. Help the Huts see the wisdom of cooperating. If you're interested, I suggest you go first to flush out and destroy any of these rebels who might lie in wait. I leave for my meeting shortly. I hope to see you there. Knowing Admiral Jafand, I'd suggest you go now. He'll expect the route to his meeting to be cleared before he leaves. This is not your battle. You were not one of the Sith who came to my world to destroy it. It is the Admiral who led that attack. It is the Admiral who will die for it. So, you're the one who thinks he can defeat the Empire? I do not know if I can, only that I must. I am Gendai. My people had done nothing to your Empire when they set upon us. They tore our world apart, slaughtered our children, or sold them as slaves. In fact, every species here has suffered an unprovoked attack by your empire. He's a terrorist. He raised an army against the empire. Destroy him! No man may strike against the empire and live. You've already learned that I do not die easily. You forget. I've been on your world. I know the secret of your people. And I have no hearts or brains to fail. The only way to destroy them is to shred the bodies and scatter them. But we proved a billion times over that they're not immortal, right, Gendai? How many have you crawled away? Two? Ten? Kill him! Kill them all! It was my fortune and my honor to have you here, my lord. I'll call Agent Maddle and tell her what happened. I suggest you make the full report. My men and I will stay here to ensure the Gendai's body is destroyed. Without him, the alien's rebellion should fall quickly. I'm certain Agent Maddle will be able to mop up any resistors. Thank you for your service.
I just received word from Admiral Jafand. He says thanks to you, the flame is dead and the rebellion is in chaos. I assume I should have the ranker's share of any reward money? Of course. It's being credited to your account right now. If you would take on another task for us, I have a message from General Colvin of the Imperial Reclamation Service. He believes you might be key to recovering the secret the Empire has sought for decades. Thank you for all you've done. Select an available travel route. Have a safe and pleasant stay. Word spread through the streets that Rathari's conference with the Huts was invaded and his apprentice killed. No one knows who slaughtered the Huts, so I'm very impressed. The Empire's alliance is intact. It's too bad Rathari wasn't in attendance. But man, I bet he's fuming. If he'd been there, his corpse would be steaming. All in good time. He's not the type to duck a fight. Rathari's also on the verge of taking over the Republic's base of operations in the upper industrial sites. With his work with the cartel dashed, he's sure to pour himself into squashing the Republic garrison. I'll keep banging down doors until I find him. Tenacity is a prerequisite for Sith, I think. Even if Rathari isn't there, when his operations are all thwarted, I know he'll come to you. A confrontation will be inevitable. select an available travel route. Have a safe and pleasant stay.
Welcome, my lord. I'm General Colvin, the mission leader here. If you have a moment, I could use your assistance. The Emperor has ordered me to unravel a great enigma in this sector, a complex constructed centuries ago by a Sith named Darth Revan. Upon its completion, Revan sealed a mysterious cargo inside, along with many alien slaves. Nothing has exited or entered since. If nothing has come out, I'm guessing it's a tomb. If so, it's the best guarded tomb in the galaxy. The complex is fortified with self-repairing automated defense turrets and a seemingly inexhaustible supply of assassin droids. It's amazing technology. We've spent over a decade trying to breach those defenses and failed. Once I put my mind to something, nothing in the galaxy can stop me. I've discovered that the complex's defenses draw power from reactors across this sector. The owners of these reactors are completely unaware. Unfortunately, they're also our enemies. Republic Special Forces, criminal cartels and mercenary armies. They'll never willingly shut down their reactors. I will shut down these reactors and crush any opposition. You honour me, my lord. Finally, accessing Revan's complex means shutting down every reactor powering its defences. If even one remains active, we'll never make it inside. Good luck.
haunt you. Check, I still have all my parts. back rally here my lord what is the meaning of this we are on the verge of striking a major blow to the republic i am general clickton commanding on the authority of sith lord rathari appointed to nar Shaddaa by the dark council why do you attack the empire's men where is your master hiding he is attending to other matters you belong to darth barras i was given instructions to destroy you if you were foolish enough to show your face here let me save you the trouble Full attack! <laughs> Sir, the Sith strength has been spent obliterating our enemy. We should strike while there's a chance. After that display, Weglin, I believe fighting should be our last resort. Stay back and cover me. Sith, I am Commander Nolan. I'm in charge of this defensive. I'm unarmed. That was a grave mistake. Ow! No, men, fire at will. <laughs> My lord, my base! My base is under attack! The last of my men and I are holed up in the command center, but the doors are about to give! Who's responsible for the attack? I don't know! We had no warning! The command center's been breached! I've never seen such power. Oh no. I dealt with the reactors. Revan's complex is defenseless, General Colvin. Magnificent. After all these years, we'll finally learn what secrets Revan left behind. Since you made this possible, it's only fair you be the first to explore Revan's complex. Find out what happened to the alien slaves, recover Revan's mysterious cargo, and return with your discoveries. I would be more than proud to help. With the reactors down, your job will be considerably less impossible than before. Good luck.
Manubaraka Kala ama nani mami, libik bak, bimka naya nugan, e jinim naya lak unan mege. Mem amgap kugap, e kramanik, umka kiga mayamak, nakag agib kik benabab, neya agam berakaki. Kam inu nemuk, naja naya akam memnik miraka. Meraka karam kara, and ninyamak ora mag yang megik. Meraka gemyam amgam nemno, namgam pak unaki jak. Amun, Jirami Nika Pula Kemgam. Naya Narankam, Kala Ama Nani Mami, Libik Bak. Kala Jiwa Nimok, Pemgam Nyama Naya Aikam. Jukagi Ne Paninu, Hamkam Bina Bek Nemu Kemgam. Kamperem Ganyam Baji Yang, Mani Kikum Bokam. Come on, Nemega, Nakaka. Manalak Laki, Nabi Nekamaraka.
Kakini Benak. Kinira Kipam Nahum. Beraka Karam Kara. And Ninyamak Oramag Yang Nigik. Revan brought you people here centuries ago. How are you still alive? Kala Jiwa Nimok. E Bengam Nyama Naya Ayam. Yang Beluamka. Kalima Naya Kira. Nebua Ribok. Naya Narankam. Kala Ama Mani Mami. Libik Bak. Tell me everything you know about the Infinite Engine. Starting with where it came from. Nibaga Glamka. Gakyam. Glagnimu Amya Galak. Kam Inu Nemuk. Naja Naya Akam Memnik Miraka. Laporam Amka. Mamni Nigag. Nagnaya Mamni Kamgram. Your services are no longer required. Give that machine to me. Nulilak Apa Jam Kamgram. Amka nem nang nemua inuk. Manub meraka naja. Kinamabam. Yak manala. Jukagi ne paninu. Amkam bina bek nemu kemgram. I'm not leaving here without that machine. Meraka kemyam amgam nemnu. Namgam pak umaki jak. Here is the secret Darth Revan was hiding from us in that complex. I can feel it humming with power. What is it? Some sort of device? The descendants of Revan's slaves were worshipping it. They called it their infinite engine. Fascinating. If Revan was hiding this, it must be astonishingly powerful. Those descendants of Revan's slaves you mentioned, are the aliens still alive? The ones I didn't kill won't survive without this machine. Excellent. I despise loose ends. The Emperor will be pleased. You've done a commendable job. I'll have this machine transported to Drummond Cass for study. With any luck, we can put it to good use. I suspect that technology will be of great value to the Empire. I've just received a request for assistance from my colleague Major Danris in network access. If you visit that sector, he could use you. Select an available travel route. Have a safe and pleasant stay.
it's clear. Darth Barris failed to inform you exactly who you'd be crossing. This demonstration should make up for that deficiency. You want Agent Delicon. You want me. I won't be hard to find anymore. I'm on the roof of the satellite platform in network access. If you dare show, I will grant you a duel to the death. Be honored. <laughs> He's a moron if he thinks we're gonna walk into such an obvious ambush. Right? Rathari is my mission, so I'll withstand whatever trap he springs. Guess that means I will too. All right, let's see what's waiting for us then. Pads are currently open for business. Have a safe and pleasant stay. A moment, if you please, my lord. Major Damaris, Ministry of War. Your skills are needed for a mission of great urgency. What's this got to do with that hut? My associate, Kabura the Hut. His cartel operates the Network Access District, the central hub for the entire galactic holonet. This is a major threat to Imperial security. Breaching the Hut's defenses and assuming this level of control should have been impossible. We need you to investigate. Immediately. I'll be glad to find the culprit for you, Major. Your skills make you uniquely suited to deal with this. The main data center is almost impenetrable. A series of well-guarded consoles is spread throughout network access, each with its own time-sensitive code. Get all the codes, then hurry to the data center. Once you reach the data center access terminal with all of the timed codes, we'll contact you with further instructions. Is that clear? Get the codes, blast the consoles, call you when I'm there. Best of luck.
This always does the trick. You've input the codes. Excellent. Kabora. Rundi kaba, kyo topa, bupanda bakamushanita. Then this is it. Hurry into the data center, locate the saboteur, and eliminate him. Now you'll see what a Sith is capable of. Be ready for anything. Dammer us out. You have arrived. I am Axis, the knowledge-seeking. You see, I am completely untouchable. We will now come to an arrangement that benefits us both. Why should the Empire consider an arrangement? I am learning all things, all information, all secrets, all data in the galaxy. I will gladly relay all I learned to your Empire. But I must remain here. That is the arrangement you are going to accept. I survive? and the Empire gains knowledge and advantage. What if I don't agree to the arrangement? Impossible. The benefit is too great, therefore you will not refuse it. The arrangement depends on secrecy. The Huts will not tolerate my presence here. Therefore they must believe I have been killed. Large generators power this facility. You will overload all but the backup. The facility will be devastated and I will appear to have been killed. That sounds simple enough. Yes. So long as the backup generator operates normally, my shields will remain. I will survive and your empire will profit. The generators are well defended. Tread carefully and be prepared for the rewards of infinite knowledge.
This should keep the Empire's secrets secure. This is Major Damaros. We registered a large explosion inside the data center. Has the target been eliminated? I was successful. Excellent. We're fortunate you could take part in the mission. Kabura informs me that the Hut's backup systems are rerouting data successfully. The Holonet survives for another day. I must report to the Minister of War. Your assistance in this matter will not be forgotten. Damaros out. This always does the trick. Lord Rathari, I presume. Finally, we come face to face. Ah, you showed. You lack your master's caution. I applaud that. Delacon, Barris's lackey is here. So, say your piece, and do it before I kill this would-be assassin. Barris is insane and paranoid. I was a faithful servant, and my cover was intact. Did he expect me to accept being murdered for reassurance? Just wait for death? You knew the risks of the job when you took it. And how to avoid them. Lord Rathari protects me now, and all of Barris's secrets will be his. 
In a hundred years, when I am legendary within the Sith, your and Barriss's deaths at my hands will not even be a footnote. However, I would never lower myself to duel a mere apprentice such as you. You haven't earned the honor. A Sith Lord should be a man of his word. So naive. Lies and deception are important weapons in every Sith's arsenal. These men are my elite guard, trained to take on Sith. Half of them could kill you, but I don't like to play favorites. In that case, I'll destroy them all. If you're in a hurry to die, I am happy to oblige you. All attack! I yield. Never have I witnessed such raw power. The day and the planet are yours. I freely pass the scepter. The threat Delicon posed to you and your master has died with him. I hope it ingratiates me in some way. Thank you for ending that miserable wretch for me. It's my fault he lived as long as he did. It's clear to me now. Someday, you will rise above your master. It is you, not I, who will be Darth Barriss's end. Grant me mercy, so I may live to see it. Honor me with some small hand in it. I make you my minion to be called into service when I see fit. Yes. I shall wait with patience for your summons. I leave you to your business, my lord. Remember, I am at your disposal. Whenever you may seek to topple Barras. From here on, that is your only interest in the galaxy. You have siphoned all other ambition from me. <sighs> Glad this is finally over. Maybe we can go back to the ship and get off this rock, huh? You haven't enjoyed Narshadar, Bet? What's to enjoy? So dark and scummy? Ugh. Gives me the creeps. I just can't wait to get back to my quarters and grab some shut-eye. You have done well, my apprentice. Delicon eliminated and Lord Rathari dispelled. This will be a day long remembered. The loss of Haladron Sitson is unfortunate, but the ends far justify the means. She will be easily replaced. Yes, I will place my slave operations in good hands, rest assured. Now, before I unleash you on Noman Carr and his Padawan, my spy on Balmora must be eliminated. Go now and be swift.